And what's up everybody, this is Big Ben 9989 how y'all doing? I'm actually doing a recording for once. This actually isn't a stream. I'm actually shocked with myself. I don't know why, but I am for you guys. Now, oh, excuse me. A lot of people have problems with the space engineers now because DirectX and... That is so weird. I really hate this stupid thing. I wish I could put my stuff over here. Anyway, beside the point. I'm a little out, out of the box right now. But Space Engineers actually has a problem. So say you open it up and you launch it. The current version of the game requires a DX11 card and you would like to play the game without it. You need to go back to a previous version. Now, you could do that. But... Like, say you have the X12 version, right? Since it is backwards compatible, you only have to change one itty -bitty little thing. I'll go ahead and put it in the description below. But basically, I was actually searching this up. Uh, a dude actually had the same problem I did, X12. So I looked this up, and I'll actually put this in the description below. And I'll go ahead and walk you through on how to get there. So I'm just going to have it over here on the side. Then I'm going to go ahead and... Oh, nope, don't need you. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and open up uh, my Cortana thingamabob, percent app data, percent, All right, file folder, open it up. So you have to scroll down to Space Engineers, right here. Now it's going to say, uh, alright, uh, a file called spaceengineers.cgf, which is this for me right now. Um, but when you're done changing this, then go ahead and create a shortcut. Now, it's really the same thing, uh, just a copy of it. Now, you have to, when you open it up, you can do one of two things. Uh, you can either go ahead and click Control F, which is the little search thing, and you can search in the, uh, DirectX, whatever. Um, and it's some number, so for me, it was nine. All you have to change is to 11. That is the only change. Um, so go ahead and save that. And look at that. It's a, just a manual change. That's all you have to do. And since DirectX 12 is backwards compatible, I just want to make sure that this is changed. 11, all that. Uh, go ahead and make that extra copy and just put it on your desktop. Then what you go to, Space Engineers, wait for it. Wait for it. All right, you got to wait for it. It's going to take a second to load. Do, 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 Look at that. You can go and do new world, custom world, do whatever you need to do. And it has all the new updates and all that. You still can go to the workshop. Everything now works. Look at that. Bravo. So that's just a manual change or manual way to change it from DirectX 9 to DirectX 11-12, whatever it is. Um, and that's just on how you change it in the config file. And I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Don't be afraid to check out my other streams, some of my other videos. And hopefully I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, guys. And